Hey Earth Signs and welcome to my channel. I'm doing your Monday, October 8th love reading for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Um, some of you are dealing with an air sign as I keep getting swords that are flying out. Let's see. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn in that order. Those are the same. I'm going to keep shuffling. Those are the same three cards as my last reading. We'll give a couple good shuffles here. All right, one more. Whoa, that was ugly. <laughs> Let me try that again. All right, Earth Signs, you guys are at a crossroads. You're looking within to see what it is that um, you feel you're destined for, what it is that you feel um, is out there for you in life. Where do you want to go? Where are you headed? Um, do you have somebody waiting for you um, to make this choice, to make this uh, break away from where you're at? Because the, the Three of Cups is in reverse. So ending of a third party, um, three become two. Ending one relationship to commit to another. Um, yeah. All right, Taurus. You guys have the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Ooh, Virgos, Ace of Wands, new beginnings for you. Three, two, one. And Capricorn, judgment. Nice. All right. So, um, Taurus, you may be feeling a little rough today. Um, you could be experiencing um, some heartbreak. You could have been a part of a third party and you're finding out about this. Um, but you're setting out on your journey. You're setting out on a new, in a new direction. Um, you know that in the future you're going to have the world in your hands. But right now, it's just you looking out. Um, over the land deciding which direction you're going to go um, because no matter where you go you just want this heartbreak to end you want this heartache to be over with um, you're going to take a little time in needing to get grounded to um, to uh, do some healing most definitely some healing Taurus males Taurus females. Thank you, spirit. All right. So Taurus males, most definitely you're in need of healing. You were really hurt. You were really devastated by this situation with temperance in reverse. Um, it's calling for you to find balance. It's calling for you to find self healing and just to concentrate on you. Um, and things are going to get better. Um, you're impatient as well about for a different group of you, you're impatient about waiting for a fire sign to come towards you um, because they could be the one that is in a third party. Taurus females, you have the queen of wands. There could be a fire sign female that is in your life that you feel is making you unbalanced. Um, you feel like they took away from you something. It could be this third party, um, but you feel like this person um, took away your stability, took away your ability to be grounded and feel confident you're lacking self-confidence because of this person could be a per the other person in the third party or it could be like a mother figure who's you know talks down on you or um a sister an aunt some some fire sign female in your life is making you feel very uh insecure and and really stealing your confidence but really you are the nine of pentacles you are amazing um, just right now you, you're feeling like you're not, and it has something to do with a fire sign female in your life. And this three of cups, uh, Virgo, you guys look awesome. You were in a third party. You narrowed it down to you and one other person, and you are ready for a passionate new beginning. Virgo males. Oh, Virgo males. 
There we go. Virgo females. Oh, wow. All right. So page of pentacles for you Virgo males. You guys are getting ready to offer your love. Give whatever you have to a fire sign um, to offer them a passionate new beginning. Here's something tangible. I know I made you promises in the past. I know I told you that I was leaving somebody in the past, but never did. But this time it's true. It's real. Here I am. I'm at my crossroads. I've made a decision. I'm picking the path that is going to give me the whole world. And I have this passionate new beginning with grounding stability, financial, financial um, stability, and just a whole new beginning for you. Are you going to take it? You are offering a fire sign, a tangible commitment today. Uh, Virgo females, you guys have the 10 of wands. You're coming to the end of a cycle and you're going to have a new beginning as well. Um, yours goes one, two, or one, 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 two, 10, which brings you into your new beginning. So you are offering a new, uh, beginning to somebody after you leave a different relationship. This is a relationship that you're in. You have the two parties. Um, you are leaving the one that is burdensome. Um, when you come to this crossroads today and you're going to, you're going to decide to take the more passionate route, the one that, uh, that you desire that the magnetic connection is just popping. Uh, but you have to end this third party and I see you doing that. Capricorn, you guys are having a second chance at love. Judgment is here. You have answered for all your karma. You have paid your karmic debts and you are ready for love. Judgment. Or <laughs> Capricorn males. Capricorn females. Whoa. All right. So Capricorn males, you have the eight of wands. You've cut somebody off in the past um, or they cut you off due to a third party. Um, communication is going to open back up. Uh, once you decide what direction you're going to go, they are not having anything to do with a third party. They are standing their ground and they're telling you to get a hold of me when you're ready to choose, not before. You're making a choice, so you're going to open back up communication with them. Capricorn females, you guys have the Knight of Swords in reverse, so you're no longer um, trying to track somebody down or or get them to pick you or whatever this third party had caused. You are done and over it. Um, and when you do that, they are going to uh, quit being so uh, reserved, so um, standoffish. They are very uh, selfish with their feelings. They weren't sharing with you how they felt. You two are going to open up to each other and tell each other exactly how you feel. And you're going to decide that, uh, that we're going to make a second go at this relationship. Because the third party is now over. All right. Let's see what the angels have for you today. Monday, the October 8th for our earth science. One card, please. Angels. One card for Monday. There we go. Your bottom of your deck is separation. So this is most definitely dealing with somebody that was in a third party, a twin flame, soulmate connection, time apart from your partner. Um, give the relationship a chance. It will come to fruition when it is ready. Um, work on your partnership, work on yourself, continue to heal. And um, when it is time, the separation will end and you guys will be able to come into a beautiful uh, reunion uh, Taurus, you guys need some healing, um, most definitely from someone that broke your heart. Uh, Virgo, you guys look like you're good to go. You're, you guys are coming back into a relationship with a fire sign very soon. And um, Capricorn, you guys look amazing as well. So I hope you guys have a beautiful Monday. I will see you next time. God bless.